First stop of the day, Glendora, California, Valley Thrift. Let's go. Look at these hard wooden cocks. Oh my God. Brown pounders. Yeah, baby. Top fuel. Chicago Joe. 29 fucking dollars. Not feeling so good after finding out that shirt was $30. How you doing? This is sick as fuck. Dude, I'm at the wrong fucking place. Eh. No Pendleton's here, but got myself some diapies. For all you Disney fans out there, yep. You would think if they're gonna try and plunge out a turd out of you, they would actually let you use the restroom. I ended up grabbing some stuff, but holy fuck, those prices were outrageous in there. Damn. All right, off to the next. <laughs> Check out Roscoe Soul Train on eBay. Gonna go ahead and apologize right now. I was in Azusa and not Glendora. Now we are in Glendora and we are at the new Unto Others thrift store. And guess what? Every tag on sale, baby. Let's go inside to the thingy, wingy, jingy, bachelor, boogie, jingy. Oh, oh. This is cool. It's like an old Polaroid land camera. I kind of like this. How fitting these are ducks colors too. <laughs> Another grail. Not gonna lie, I fucking love this. I think I got some things in here. Some things. I'm. Yeah, that was a, that's a haul, baby. Yeah, that's a good place. I like this place a lot. Yeah. Pardon. Yeah, baby. Subscribe and wrinkle it, dingle it, do. Still in Glendora. You know what? Goodwill. Let's go in here and find out if they got anything. They probably don't, but that's okay. We're going to try anyway. Jumpa jingus. Amanda, what's this? What do we got over here? Randy Madden? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. What are you doing here, dude? Oh, man, just looking through crap to find more That's crap. So crazy. Wow. Woo. Hey, man, I got my chopper parked out back. What? Can I ride on the back of it? Wait. Please? So, where are we? Glendora. We're in Glendora. It's confirmed. Why don't I just hop in your car and we just drift all day? Yeah, baby. Let's do it. <laughs> ah. Woo. Woo. Look out. <laughs> this is a giant turd right here. <laughs> Randy said this turd is stupid. I think it's cute. That's Randy. The thong song was an absolute banger. Ramen. What's this? Hi, I'm Ted the Bear. <laughs> yeah, I smoke some weed. Definitely an interesting find right here. Randy found this earlier. The Sportsman? What the? F I don't know. It's from '61. I don't know nothing about it though. Hey, you want a hand? <laughs> <laughs> Ross, is that you? <gasps> oh yeah, Goodwill. What'd you find, Randy? Find anything good? Hey, oh, got nothing, baby. Hey, but guess what? I found you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we found each other, so now we're gonna keep keep this train rolling. All right, let's go. Thumbs up, brother. Here I am, Salvation Army, Azusa, California. We're with this guy here. Randy has a good feeling about this, so let's let's go. <laughs> like Drake, you know what I'm saying? Hi. Like Phil Kessel, you know what I'm saying? Hi. There's a hefty fucking pay. Gumball is a great show. Loud and proud, brother. <laughs> You know, I actually, I actually caught him slipping in there a little bit. So, yeah, cool. Look at that. Boom, 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 boom. Shee beep, shee beep, shee kapo, pushy, kapo, be ya. Shing a bum, bum, bing, shum, bing. Well, where are we going now? We're gonna go somewhere. We're gonna go take a poo. Is what we're gonna do. Hey. <laughs> okay, we had to drop off a TwitchCon bag to uh, Luke's Keebs on YouTube. So here you go. But look, oh. Luke's got a special talent. He's a screamer. Ah! I'm gonna evict this. Woo! Yeah, baby! Round two! Here we are in Pasadena. I'm out here with Rock and Randy Madden. Yeah, baby! Rock and roll, Randy! I just broke my freaking tooth. Oh, rock and roll, Randy! Just broke my tooth with this necklace. Rock and roll, Randy! Yeah! We're gonna get some sugar and I'm gonna We're gonna music. act like a bunch of rail! <laughs> Tight. <laughs> Fanny Falaskui. <laughs> So, uh, Ross and I just struck out, baby. Today was ass with Star. Oh, good one. He said. I used that joke earlier in another video that you should watch. I actually found some fucking good shit 
over there one time. But today, it was nothing but a fucking dog wiener. Whoa, is that a knife? Axe, thrift store, Pasadena, no go today. Yeah, it was fucking sucky. Woo, I'm glad you found me at the other place. Now yeah. you gotta get me back to my motor chopper, baby. Let's get you back to the chopper. Hey, get me back to the chopper. All right, and let's go back and see what we found today. Okay, so we got a lot of ground to cover. So here's Akio, my buddy, checking out this Polaroid that I got. How's it going? Yeah, baby. Yeah. So this is a Polaroid camera. Sick Polaroid flash, probably super rare. But usually for these cameras, there's usually something up here in the front that you can... Wing jangle? Kind of like... Oh, yeah, there we go. So there nice. it is. Yeah, baby. And boom. Look at this shit. Look at that. What a cool piece. It's folded in place here with that. And I think whoever had this must have been like a hardcore Polaroid person. Yeah. So there's the manual electric. Oh, there's the manual. There it is. Oh, there you go. Sick. That's how you load it. Okay. So does this take like standard Polaroid film or does it take something different? I don't even know. We we'll have to read into it. But look at that. Look at how big your negative is going to be. Your print is going to be just so creamy with all of that. This looks like our talking lever manual we can adjust the exposure there range finder which means that by moving this i don't know dude. <laughs> crazy but that is sick right there that that would make one sick sick polaroid yeah dude fucking take it home and play with it man we'll enjoy see, we'll see what we can do with it oh yeah baby all right akil you're the man dude Fuck yeah. All right, so I also picked up another Polaroid camera and this one is still in the package. It's a impulse autofocus. Apparently this thing has like a cool depth of field. My buddy Jason was talking about it with me the other day, but this thing is still in the package. It's never been used. Awesome find. When I was up north, I picked up these Jordan Spike 50s. They are super clean and had to get them. I also found these uh, rose gold uh, Adidas shell toes. These things are another super clean pair of shoes. I didn't really find any dings or dents on them at all. Like no, no heel drag, nothing. So yeah, I grabbed these guys. Randy found some of these BTS Barbie dolls. And being from Santa Rosa, not that I'm a Yankees fan, but being from Santa Rosa, partial to Peanuts gang stuff. So I picked up this Franklin bobblehead. It's a New York Yankees bobblehead. Okay, I got a ton of t-shirts. Picked up this Tesla shirt the other day. Super low key Tesla, super good shape. Disneyland after dark shirt. It glows. Another glowing shirt from Disneyland, from the Wonderground Gallery of this Hatbox Ghost t-shirt. Sucks that the Wonderground Gallery closed down. I want to say this tour was like 2009 or something, but this U2 360 tour, maybe it was 2011. Definitely caught the Salvation Army slipping on this one. Found this Greg Norman Shark t-shirt with the tag still on it. Tag says 60 bucks. Another shirt with the tag still on it. This Angels Eckstein shirt. 22, fuck yeah. I was talking to a guy a few weeks back and he told me that anytime you see a Tommy Bahama t-shirt, pick it up. So I found this Tommy Bahama fucking, I don't know, swordfish short bus t-shirt, fuck yeah. So I grabbed this super roached out Washington Redskins starter t-shirt. I'm not sure what the year is, but this definitely has seen some, some wear and tear. Cool find for any Disney fan. This is the kind of stuff you sometimes run into in LA. Film crew from the Jungle Cruise movie from 2018. The movie still hasn't come out yet, which is kind of cool, but yeah, this is great. The last shirt that I got was actually for myself. I thought it was pretty funny. It's super Canadian. It was fucking awesome. I love this shirt. So, all right, cool. This is pretty fucking cool. I found this Super Bowl from 2000. This hat still has the tags on it. Never been worn. I also found this DVD copy of Return to Sleepaway Camp, as well as for myself, Gremlins 2, the new batch. I don't know if you guys have seen Gremlins 2, but this movie's wacky as fuck. Yeah, so that was it. If you guys know of anything that I should be picking up in the thrift, please leave a comment down below. And if you personally are looking for something in the thrift, I've been looking for Pendleton shirts constantly, but I haven't found any yet. If you guys are looking for anything specific, just let me know as well in the comments and I'll keep a lookout as much as I can. I would say that this trip was pretty, pretty good. Um, those two Polaroids were definitely the finds uh, of the day and then just some of the odds and ends that I picked up too. the shoes I mean everything was pretty clean and yeah, it was a great trip. I had a good time links to Randy's social media down below Also, thank you to, to Luke. Uh, I hope you're enjoying the, uh, the fanny pack as well as the G fuel shaker and also, thank you to Casey, the barber. Hey, what are you here for? I'm, uh, whatever, whatever I could find in this place. I don't know. Woo! Yeah! Go get it! Casey's a barber. You gotta go to his What's shop. Up, man? Yeah, baby. Yeah, we're blooded, yeah two baby. shops. Woo! Casey, the barber. Come me up. Oh, my God, dude. Yeah, he needs it. He's got two shops. 
So if you're along the 210, look up Casey's Barbershop. Like him a lot. He's a Viking. Links are down below to those three sweet boys. And uh, all right, I hope you guys enjoyed. Fuck yeah, party. Uh, see you soon. <laughs> Check me out on my eBay page. And if you want to subscribe, baby, that's all right. Hey, you can check me out on my eBay page. And if you want to subscribe, baby, that's all right.